Okay, now I will introduce the uh, Valoris Map Plus Baron.ai. It's a showcasing generative AI powered geospatial data platform, a pioneering product plan. And uh, we collaborate with the um, Cameo, we collaborate with IBIS, uh, Valoris uh, Maps. Um, and it, uh, in, on this platform, it got uh, uh, several data and visualized uh, geospatial analysis tools on this platform, uh, Valoris Maps. And with the growth of generative AI, we uh, Cameo, we pro uh, provide this Baron AI generative AI bot service uh, and can integrate with the IBIS uh, Valoris Maps. And we uh, the the system will be like this. When you click on the as application, when you click on the the generative AI uh, for the an analyze, um, it will call out the AI bots, and you can provide some kind of uh, use uh, use that uh, generative AI bots to uh, help you uh, several uh, geospatial analysis tasks. And here's a demonstrating use case. Uh, in this case, we want to uh, analyze the sources and pattern of air pollution in Bangkok. And as we know, Bangkok really uh, usually has a uh, thick layer of smoke uh, with these kind of air pollution issues. And in this platform, we uh, can apply, integrate those uh, air, uh, the data from IoT sensor and uh, satellite graph. Uh, this is one. Uh, uh, data set example, the data input from the, the fire point from satellite to uh, capture those data. The the those fire points uh, is a has you could have a hotspot or or it means maybe there's got uh, usually got a fire over this place and we the on the HP we got the uh, time, the brightness, and uh, latitude longitude and the time. And we just filter the, the the higher brightness value means that maybe there's a fire over here, and compare it with uh, correlate with this uh, this data from collected by the IoT sensors, and uh, we got this PN two point five. PN two point five. The higher the value means uh, means that's uh, more air pollution, the smog. Yeah, and we also got have this uh, created time time and latitude and longitude value. And with these two data and uh, firstly the simple application you can just uh, because you customize uh, you know, an analyze uh, issue and you can just provide uh, those two data source to the bus and ask the bot to uh, generate the visualized map for you. And as you can see uh, we pass those uh, data API for the, for the generate the AI bus and you currently is writing the visualized uh, code uh, and we click on the, the link and you can open up this uh, this visualized map over here yeah and over here you can see uh, you can you uh, uh, correlate this to data set it's up in 2.5 and the five point on the on the same uh, website and can visualize with this map and you can see the orange one is uh is uh means there's air pollution and further uh, uh there's uh we could provide this uh special autocorrelation analysis it means it means we can have the, have the fire brightness versus pn 2.5 we want to know which days really correlate to each other so here we uh, use this uh, uh, spatial correlation analysis the algorithm. It's, uh, it's a more an eye indicator. Um, we can ask the spatial analysis. This this uh, this is another bot. With this bot, uh, spatial analysis bot, we can and provide also provides two data source for that. And you would currently here. Uh, you just as you say this to data set data source and you generate the just special uh it's a statistic uh, statistical model to to uh to analyze uh, whether whether these two data set are 
uh, correlate to each other yeah and then you will generate the indicator value and we can further ask it to uh, to help you explain the data and we apply this uh, this an analysis uh, with several days you know and uh, um, we, we got a data set of uh, this uh, uh, 2024 it's uh, February 12th uh, from February 10th to February 12th and we found out uh, the fire brightness of uh, February 10th have the uh, highest uh, more in I in the, in the, the, the this value it's a uh, analysis we can explain in the, this on the February 10th 2024 the spatial analysis of fire brightness revealed a significant positive spatial autocorrelation, uh, suggesting the areas of this high fire intensity were specially clustered and potentially contributing to elevate the PN 2.5 concentration in this region. Okay, it means uh, on this day when the fire brightness. Uh, uh, you have got this higher value and you will cause the, the PN 2.5 uh, on the bank card. and this is um, this is the, the value you can see the static, statical uh, uh, is that is statistical and analyzing and and further you can ask the bot uh, to explain this kind of what we which, what kind of what we should how to interpret this uh, statistical analysis result the first the analysis on Moran's uh, eyes value identify this the highest value um, and the highest value uh, the positive uh, means there's a really significant uh, correlation and uh, I uh, understand the delay in impact is a uh, uh, dispersion dynamics uh, in, with, with this uh, you can understand how to interpret this value and the predictive insight will also provide you uh, you can plan in uh, it's very interesting as uh, because uh, the fire point on the February 10th you got this fire point on this February 10th and you will indicate uh, correlate with the February 12th of PN 2.5 in Bangkok. It means you got a two days uh, uh, delays, right? So it means uh, why do you, uh, when you uh, uh, observe this uh, fire point in this area, and actually you can allow those citizens of the Bangkok, uh, and you got two days to. Uh, to uh, to to uh, have this uh, policy to prevent those air pollution, and further, uh, we visualize it with uh, our visualized point. We can ask it to generate its a uh, visualized uh, platform, as we just say. You got uh, it's a five points. We can find out the bank is over over here, and uh, north is a north. This is a mountain area over here. You got the five points on. Uh, the February 10th and uh, as we see uh, the February 12th uh, the, 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 the orange one orange spot means that's a uh, unhealthy uh, sensitive uh, this uh, unhealthy PN 2.5 pollution getting serious they will cause this uh, pollution on uh, February 12th and so this is those uh, this uh, spatial analysis result and then the northern file induced uh, 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 PN 2.5 two day lag effects in Penka. Yeah, this is also the fire point. With after two days, you got a, got this uh, uh, this uh, pollution. So that's uh, we found out while well, we found out this inside, we can uh, use this analysis result to generate the report and. Uh, have more, uh, you know, uh, observing have a, a long system or observing those uh, fire points to uh, to predict that uh, maybe that's uh, for the sensitive area. That, for example, the Bangkok, this is city, uh, several cities that uh, live here. Uh, While well, that's uh, fire points observed, and you can quickly uh, along those uh, uh, send along to uh, the, the system uh, for 
then to uh, reduce the outdoor activity, for example, to to prevent those uh, air pollution uh, to uh, yeah uh, for the health of the citizen yeah. So this uh, one showcasing we showed up those uh, the potential we have this uh, valoris maps with uh, generative AI we can have this uh, interesting uh, uh, advanced pioneering uh, analysis uh, feature and those are the this uh, this uh, the platform that which is uh, called uh, the the generative AI to generate those uh, insight for the uh, to compute this to uh, the correlation of two data set and this uh, this is uh, the platform we visualize for the visualize to interpret this insight is uh, air quality yeah it's going to be sure is uh, in as this uh, dynamic uh, animation so we can see uh, February 12th and this uh, 6 o'clock p.m. you can see uh, start from here there's a, you got a very clearly uh, air pollution from north yeah you're getting serious and we also see those uh, this is a hot fire fire point means that it's uh, observed from the satellite and uh, you can see there's several days from February 5 6 and finally we come to our as you just say the this cans yeah you see uh this this bank out over here so this uh, north northern uh, this mountain area we got several uh, fire point yeah you can know okay the location of those fire point is really caused maybe that is uh they caused the 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 air pollution two days later uh, for the Bangkok bank and can further observe the the geolog uh, relation with this two point and to find out the the Bangkok and this is a fire point you can find out what kind of activity might over here may cause uh, those uh, fire point yeah and set up several um, policy to prevent it happen again yeah to reduce the air pollution just the the uh, inside we can we found out with the integration of these two platform okay this is the demonstrator of our uh, of this the Laris map with Baron AI